We are in the most traditional hotel of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, Copacabana Palace, with Mrs. Mariana Rosa, the managing director of Passion Brazil, a DMC company established in 2003 in Rio de Janeiro. Mrs. Rosa, what Brazil is offering to its visitors? Brazil is a melting pot country with a mix of different landscapes, so here people can find very nice beaches from the south to the north and then they can also find uh, nature like Amazon forest or also nature with many animals like Pantanal or the biggest uh, waterfalls in the world, Foz do Iguaçu or also some uh, UNESCO patrimonies like historic and cultural places in Salvador, Minas Gerais, Paraty so and also city breaks, I know that the Greek clients, they like that. So, the main city for Greek, Greeks, for example, it's Rio de Janeiro. It's a city with mountains and beach and forest and uh, sports. So, you can see different uh, places in one country. Mrs. Rosa, what differentiates your company from the other DMCs in Brazil? I think the main difference uh, is that uh, we are part of a holding with four other agencies and we have a common back office department with around 80 people so uh, we have very strong power of negotiation the negotiation negotiate for the whole group with all the hotels and suppliers we are the main clients of many hotels in Brazil and we also have a very good IT department and human resources and marketing all the back office uh, it's uh, even the financial department it's very strong and it's big and on the other hand, for the clients, we have a, a, very, a, a staff who gives personalized assistance to all clients. Even, even me, I'm very accessible. I give my personal mobile to all the clients. I meet them every year. I go there. I, receive, I go to their countries. I receive them in Brazil. I meet them. I all, I'm always open 24 hours to solve any problem. So they can easily reach me and they... Even the, the staff is very accessible and at the client's disposal. Okay, what Brazil is offering to these clients, to the visitors of the country? Brazil is a, a melting pot country, so it's a mix of different landscapes. We have uh, nice beaches from south to the north, like uh, Praia do Forte or Florianópolis, Angra dos Reis, Búzio, so many beach places, islands and at the same time have very nice nature like Amazon forest and the Pantanal where they see also many animals like in Safari and uh, we have the biggest waterfalls in the world which is Foz do Iguaçu and nice city breaks like Rio de Janeiro which is uh, the main gate for Brazil with beaches and the mountains, forest and uh, the weather in Brazil is very nice it's Always time to go to Brazil. There is no bad, uh, bad season. As Brazil is a huge country, uh, what is the average of stay of people when they visit it? Um, you have in one trip, they never know Brazil completely. So you have to do many trips, at least for the first trip, at least 12, 15 days to go to three, four cities to know the essential part of Brazil. Rio, Foz do Iguaçu, Salvador and maybe Amazon. Uh, from which countries are your clients? They are mainly from France or French-speaking countries like Canada, North Africa or Belgium. And we also have some Turkish and Polish clients, some, some uh, other Eastern European countries, some from Portugal but it decreased a lot. And uh, we, we also used to have some Greek clients but it, not, not a lot for the moment. Oh, so what about the Greek and Cypriot market? Mm, from, from Cyprus, actually it's something new for me because I just met two uh, travel agents from this country that I didn't know it has that potential and they have potential for Brazil, especially for honeymooners. And from the Greek market, it used to be very important market to Brazil. But since the crisis, it decreased. Even some of our clients, I know they bankrupted. So there are new agencies, there are 
new clients potential to Brazil, even for incentive or for FIT uh, up level to Brazil. Can you tell me the profile of the visitor that is for 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 Brazil to visit Brazil? From Greece or uh, from any country? Yeah. Uh, what is the profile of visitor for Brazil? There, it depends on the country. There are different profiles. There are many people who are retired, mm -hmm. like uh, like uh, in the year 50s, 60s, they come to Brazil as um, a very long trip, like 20 days to visit, to visit historical places also. And then we have honeymooners that come to Brazil, or we also have incentive groups. That uh, companies that offer Brazil as a gift for the, the best sellers, for the, their best clients.